right, everybody, today I'm going to be walking through a few of the features, things I like, and the things I don't necessarily like about this Aquaverse water dispenser. First of all, this does not require you to put a bottle of water inside this thing down here or on top. Basically, this is tied into a water line, as you can see right there, and then on the other side, you can see that it is plugged in right over there. Now, it, this is not necessarily instant hot water, so if you are using this for hot chocolate, maybe once a day, you're gonna have a bad time. But like for churches where a lot of people are using the hot water all at once, it's gonna stay hot. I personally am using it in a home gym right here, and this is fantastic for cold, refreshing water. Let me show you. So we're gonna go ahead and put this down like so, and to actually activate this thing, you lift it up like this. And delicious. Now for the hot water, slightly different. You actually have to, uh, if you actually try to do this, it won't work, but this is a safety measure. So if you have kids, cause this is like the same height as kids, you don't want little kids going up and pushing this and scalding themselves. So this is a safety feature. See that? This is a button. So you have to push that there and then the hot water comes out. Okay. So it requires kind of two right there. I hope that makes sense. There we go. Very small kind of a footprint right here. So I do appreciate the fact that it does fit in tight little spaces. And I appreciate the fact that since you can tie it right into a water line right back there, you can see the little coupling right there, just two little brass couplings. Make sure that that is tight. Otherwise you will have a leakage. So, uh, but it hasn't leaked for me. Just make sure that you're a smart plumber. That's it, hope this helps.